area. It's about 70 miles to the southwest of Chengdu, which is in Sichuan province. Uh, from what we know, uh, the, the army are there at the moment. About 2,000 soldiers have been deployed to the area. Uh, and a general, the Chinese general, who's been flying over the region in a helicopter, has told local reporters that he's seen uh, a huge number, perhaps 50% of the houses in one area, uh, have been almost completely flattened. Of course, this is an area that is used to earthquakes, an extremely devastating earthquake back in 2008 killed 68,000 people. Now, from what we're hearing from local reports and sources who've spoken to us this morning who are there, they say this is not on that scale. Nevertheless, uh, the area, as I say, is very rural. Uh, that may help things in one respect because not many people live there, but, of course, the houses in those rural areas are not particularly well built. Uh, we know that the Chinese Prem... This is a pretty rural area. It's about 70 miles to the southwest of Chengdu, which is in Sichuan province. Uh, from what we know, uh, the, the army are there at the moment. About 2,000 soldiers have been deployed to the area. Uh, and a general, the Chinese general, who's been flying over the region in a helicopter, has told local reporters that he's seen uh, a huge number, perhaps 50% of the houses in one area, uh, have been almost completely flattened. Of course, this is an area that is used to earthquakes, an extremely devastating earthquake back in 2008 killed 68,000 people. Now, from what we're hearing from local reports and sources who've spoken to us this morning who are there, they say this is not on that scale. Nevertheless, uh, the area, as I say, is very rural. Uh, that may help things in one respect because not many people live there, but, of course, the houses in those rural areas are not particularly well built. Uh, we